Hello everyone, today I'll show you some very important settings that everyone should adjust. This applies to those who use the Google Play Store, which is where you download games and apps. There are some cleverly hidden settings that are enabled by default when you buy your smartphone, and you might not even know about them. But these settings can negatively impact your privacy. And now I'll show you, what could happen if you don't double check these features. Be sure to give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and share with your friends. So, of course, we need to use our Google Play Store which is where you download games and apps. Click here and immediately look for your avatar and the account you entered here. Because if you use Play Store, then, of course, you entered an email address to download games and apps. Click here. Next, look, we need to scroll down and find this gear. These are settings. Go here. Further down, there's a setting called, About the App. Click the arrow on the right. Then scroll down, and here you'll find a line with the Google Play firmware version. Here. These numbers are basically irrelevant to us, so we don't pay attention to them. We need to quickly click this line several times. Look, it tells me I don't need to, you're already a developer. The first time you do, it tells you congratulations, you're now a developer. Now, so you don't get confused, let me go back a little. Go back to your avatar. Scroll down. Go back to our standard settings. Now we're interested in the very top line, which is called, general settings. Click the arrow on the right and then scroll almost to the very bottom. And here you'll find a line called, for developers. Click here. Now look, you'll see a button or a slider that's active. It says here that you can download and install available test versions of apps. Sure, it sounds great that you can just go to Google Play and download whatever you want, but there's a big hidden, but. Look, if I turn this toggle off, and now watch as I turn it back on. I press, enable. And here it says, you will be able to download and install versions of apps that you've been granted access to. Such apps may not comply with Google Play's terms and conditions. So, here we're told directly that Google Play bears no responsibility if you download a test app and it doesn't work properly. These apps could carry viruses, they could harm your smartphone, for example, they could even steal your data, or after downloading a test app, your phone could become bricked, meaning it's unusable, or extremely slow. In short, there could be many different cases, but you gave this permission yourself, and no one else is responsible. So, of course, Pay attention to these settings and be sure to disable this slider to safely download other apps that have already been checked for viruses and to ensure safe use when installing any app.